Hi guys, thanks for tuning in to What's in the Box. Uh, my name's John and today we're gonna be opening a Japan candy box, which I can only assume is candy from Japan. Maybe, could be from somewhere else, but assuming it's Japan. Probably not from the United States, so candy from Japan. So uh, let's take a look and see what we got here. Japan Candy Box from japancandybox.com is, it starts at $19.90 per month. And it has a lot, hopefully a lot of really good Japanese style candy. Take this knife away from me, don't hurt me. Let's see what we got in it. Sweetness has arrived, and this is Japan Candy Box. Spring is almost here, so it's obviously their spring box. So this is Japan Candy Box. It is fully stocked with candy. So the first thing I have is ri ri Rilakkuma. Is that how you would say it? These are the Rilakkuma rice crackers. They're shaped like bear heads. It tastes like a salty rice cake. It's actually pretty good. The next thing is Super Mario either gummy bears or like fruit snacks of some kind. And it has Mario and Princess Peach and Luigi and Yoshi and mushrooms and a whole bunch of other stuff Mario related. Oh, this is a coin from Mario. It tastes fruity. And that one sort of tasted like bubble gum. Oh, that's a Mario head. They're actually, they're, they're good. They taste, they taste like fruit snacks. They're very, they're all just pretty fruit, general fruit flavored. Kalpus? Oop, these look like marshmallows that are coming out of here. They they feel like marshmallows. They're a little bit melted, but they look pretty good. Tastes like a Jet Puff marshmallow. Like, pretty pretty much similar. I'd put it in my hot chocolate. Be good. Uh, this is a pure gummy, a juicy lemon gummy. Canro pure, Canro pure gummy. It's a lemon gummy. That tastes like plastic. I thought it was like one big gummy, but it's a bunch of gummies. So these remind me, they look a lot like Sour Patch Kids. They're covered with like the sour sugar. They taste like Lemon Sour Patch Kids, almost <laughs> exactly like Lemon Sour Patch Kids. Yaukan Umebo Teriyaki Burger Snack. So I'm assuming it's gonna taste like teriyaki. So it's basically like a, a puff treat, like a, a Cheeto or something like that. It's actually really good. It tastes like teriyaki. Maruka gum. There's a cat and a weird looking kid on the front of it. Uh, and it is, yep, it's basically gum. <laughs> it's hard to chew. It's, it's, but it's, it's, no, it, um, if you ever had like Hubba Bubba grape, it's exactly the grape flavor that it tastes like. It's very, very close. It's a little more sour though. Meiji, M E I J I. Uh, it's, it's, it's a lemon candy. They almost look like Tic Tacs. So, my, it's really tiny. I like yay big. They're very tiny. Mmm. Yeah, a close approximation would be nerds or smarties. A Mito fish wafer. It looks like there's chocolate in between it. I hope it doesn't taste like fish and chocolate because that would not be very good, but it looks like a fish. It tastes like a wafer cookie with the chocolate filling in it. The chocolate filling tastes exactly the same. It doesn't taste like fish. So this is a um, this is a pudding kit. That, this is a do-it-yourself pudding kit. It is not like Jello pudding, but apparently looking. So this is what the front cover looks like. But looking at the back, you add milk and the filling and the flavor in here. You put it in a mug and put it in the microwave. Crisp choco, strawberry n Nissen with uh, strawberry flavor as well. It looks like. Yeah, kind of. It kind of does look like pocky. Whoa! It is kind of like a pizza. Maybe like a Rice Krispie treat. Actually more like if cereal was put together, not with marshmallow though, I don't know what they mix this with, but it tastes like strawberry. I would say my favorite thing out of here is probably the uh, the chocolate fish. Once again, uh, big thanks to Japan Candy Box. Please like, subscribe to this channel and for Japan Candy Box also. So this has been uh, What's in the Box. Uh, my name's John and uh, we'll see you later.